Today I want to talk about a posting setup feature, post to and post through. Let's go to our administration window and under setup and posting we're going to click on posting and let's go to purchasing series and then let's go to payables transaction entry and see how we have it set up in this company. We have it set to post to general ledger which means that the payables module is integrated to the general ledger and all transactions created there will then update the general ledger. But underneath that we have post through general ledger. Now this means if I post a batch in payables it will post the batch automatically in general ledger. Let's see how both transactions react using the feature post through turned on and post through turned off. Right now it's off so we'll leave it that way and click OK. Go to purchasing and let's go to transaction entry and we'll create a quick batch. We'll choose a travel company for $675 and we'll save that. Now let's post our batch. And we'll then go to the financial series and go to general ledger. Here's our payables transaction batch and you can see there's some other entries in here as well from other payables transactions. So let's find our payables transaction entry and here it is. So it's sitting in a batch in payables waiting to be posted. Let's just post this batch right now and then let's turn on the feature post through and see what happens. Back to administration, setup, posting and posting. We'll choose the series purchasing, we'll choose payables transaction entry, and we'll mark to post through. Let's say OK and save. Go back to purchasing, transaction entry. This time we'll choose a travel again, but we'll do $775. And let's put it in a batch. save our transaction, post the batch, let's go back to general ledger this time, and this time let's go to inquiry, journal entry inquiry and look and you can see the last transaction posted is the one we just created. So now post to and post through means whenever I post the batch in payables, it automatically posts in general ledger. Let's post a single transaction without a batch and see what happens when post through is on. So once again, I'm going to do an invoice for a travel company, except this time I won't put it in a batch, and we'll do it for 875. Oops and click on post, close the window, now let's go to the financial series and we'll start to see if it's posted and we can look and see that it is. Now keep in mind I'm using GP 2012. Previous versions did not automatically post it for us in the general ledger. I hope this helps. Thanks.